Go ahead, Jared. The response to the Todd and Aaron video was very interesting. And we actually, you know, there was quite a series of events that happened yesterday. Some of you may be aware about the Twitter argument that happened as a result <laughs> of the Todd and Aaron Award. Now, for those of you who don't know, I I almost don't even know if we should bring it up because I feel bad for the person involved. This, this don't give out the name. Some of you, if you're in the chat, the name might be out there. But there was there's a prominent... YouTuber who does Let's Plays who was watching the VGX and he made a little comment on his on his Twitter something along the lines of wow watched five seconds of whatever Todd and Aaron is and I turned it off I don't think I'll be doing this and you know that's okay we here at Mega64 we, we always find it funny when somebody doesn't appreciate the videos we put out yeah it's entertaining I, to us even like not appreciating is one thing but when they like despise it and like get this blood boiling hatred about something that we did that is when like okay now that's funny when you when you don't have anything nice to say you're not supposed to say anything at all so i always find it funny (laughs) when someone makes it a point to go publicly say something unnice yeah for no reason in my opinion in my opinion it wasn't mean it was unnice. like you can you can criticize mega 64 that's fine we won't repost everything everybody says about us but sometimes somebody will say something so stupid it's just funny and I'm sorry, but I watched five seconds of something and turned it off. Yeah, that sounds like you have a really good assessment of what you're, what you're watching. You couldn't last more than five seconds, and then you wrote about it on Twitter. Okay. So we reposted that, and a lot of our fans commented, responded to this person, to which they responded back. They got a lot of to our, to our fans. Well, yeah, that is, that's a big mistake. And they said, you know, Mega64 got butt hurt about what I said. And sicked their fans on me, which, you know, we thought was funny. And that just perpetuated everything because then everybody started saying, Mega 64 got butt hurt. Okay, dude. Okay. Then there was a third, (laughs) there there, there was a third tweet by this individual. And this was so fucking funny to me. My day was fucking made yesterday (laughs) when I read this tweet. (laughs) The person responded, he wrote a third time and said, apparently, Mega 64's video was a satire. I don't get it. <laughs> is, is, the v, is the VGX a gaming show or SNL? He didn't understand that Todd and Aaron was a satire. Well, he didn't watch more than five seconds He of watched it. five seconds. The first award we gave out was most anticipated game of the next generation, a tie, a between, tie. A tie between Madden <laughs> and Call of Duty. He turned it off because he didn't realize that was a satire. <laughs> Best Those joke of the year was ooh ya. He didn't realize that was a satire. You know, I could say all these things making fun of him, but really the Twitter response, he got about 100 <laughs> responses at him just saying, wow, you're a fucking idiot. And I spent about a good half oh, hour nice. just reading everybody talking to this guy. <laughs> dumb. To the point where I felt bad for him. So Poor guy. That happened yesterday. That was one response. And then... Another response, which we were not expecting at all, yeah, was but, from Ouya. Yeah, the Twitter thing that was just funny. That happens. Twitter fights. Twitter fights happen every day. That's not news. They're funny. They, they are funny. They're fun. People get so mad. It's they are fun. Our Todd and Aaron video actually had an article written about it, <laughs> where they interviewed the CEO of one of the companies. That we mentioned in our video to get an official response, and I didn't know about I didn't know about this article until just a few minutes ago. I just found out about it. Do you want to read the article? You have it up on the screen. Can the people at home see this? No, they cannot. No, so you should, right, you should read all right. it. Yeah, all right. Would, I'll read I would the article. Read the whole thing. Oh no, I'll read the article. Oh, then by all means, I'll read it. If I'll, you can read it, please. I'll just need you to scroll down. So this is posted on what? P4RGaming.com. Yes, correct. <laughs> the legendary. Go ahead, scroll up so I can read the headline of this article. Oh, okay. Ooya CEO accepts the award for joke of the year from the VGX <laughs> award show. We uh, we nominated Ooya as best joke of the year, and then we laughed at the fact that it exists. <laughs> <laughs> this is what the CEO had to say. Oh, I'm sorry. Can I ask a question? Yes. Yeah, go ahead. So what's Ooya? So Ooya, for those of you who don't know, it's a new console. It was it's made for me. I'm the only one. It, it was made it. independently to you know. Kind of these indie developers were like, there's Nintendo, there's PlayStation, there's Xbox, there's only three consoles. We're going to make our own, and it's called Ooya. You can download 
uh, like Android games. They're the green. Party it's like an games. open exactly. source kind of thing. Now yeah. the, right, the back, joke to us is that nobody has an Ouya, and a lot of people who do couldn't get it to work. One of them being Rocco. Rocco peed on his Ouya because he was so angry at it. He po he posted a video online of him taking a piss on his Ouya, and then YouTube took it down as being like, uh, well, flag too, for drug use. Yeah, too much. So, anyways. Oh wait. Yeah. Oh, his hands is a satire. Article. Oh, really? Oh, we didn't get the sat. Oh, how ironic is that? Oh, the satire the fuck? Then it's satire. What? P4 Gaming isn't a real site. I can't believe they didn't know. Oh, it's a satirical website. It's a satirical oh. website. Well then, oh. Oh. Oh my God. I'll stop right here because oh, no. I read this article ten minutes ago. And oh. uh, is this? Oh. I don't get it. Oh shit! So the it's... website's a fake website. Oh, it's no. gaming for the onion. Well then, oh, gaming for the oh, onion. Oh no, is this hell? Wait, now oh, I'm no. confused. Wait, I d I don't wait. Get okay, hold on. <laughs> so that satire website just took our joke and elaborated on our joke. Maybe. <laughs> I'm so confused. They tagged it. They put a little is tag. Is their on website it. like SNL? I'm sorry, guys. Oh. Go back, go, go back to Did the you guys see the SNL Should bit put, of what does my girlfriend say? Eric, put the website back up. <laughs> I don't care. Fuck it. So I made a mistake. Is that a mistake? No, 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 that no. That was the article we Someone's read. Someone's going getting sued. I've heard about people like. So what's the other? What's the other post? Play no, for real. Where post. gaming journalism lifts up. The Penny Arcade Report, famous satirical video journalism website, shuts down. Dice plans to spend two years solely dedicated to fixing battlefield. There's for. fake video game news websites. Is that a th are these, are these fake? <laughs> Why is that for yeah. real? Yeah. If someone was to be like Miss Pac-Man, because like from the we dead, do see the irony of the fact that we didn't get I, that was yeah, satire, right? The, we, uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. How well, it come it doesn't say this is like hey. the SNL website? Hey, as oh. people who know comedy and what's funny, like that is this is a hilarious situation. <laughs> you guys, I know comedy. Uh, I'm, I'm a professional <laughs> comedian. And one of my favorite things to read is fake video game news. <laughs> <laughs> what I, a great... laugh, I can't stop laughing when I read someone just cracking jokes about PlayStation and Xbox. Man, I'll tell you, if there was ever a thing to spend your time on, it would be building a like an onion type site. No, but that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> no, that's it's okay. not. I don't know because I've ever I've heard of people mistaking. Shit know. on Twitter gets <laughs> thrown all the fuck around about fake news sites. Like stories on fake news sites that aren't the onions. It's something that someone Dude, doesn't the onion know. On Twitter is the best thing. No, fake. that's fine. I don't care. All right. know the onion Okay, is so it's a fucking satire site. That's okay. But that article was just a fake interview with a CEO. And then they quoted Rocco, which. Did they quote Rocco? Rocco? He's not here to quote? Who Rocco's not here. Did he say that? I you know, don't know, but you know, like Rocco does a lot of, you know, gives out quotes all the time. I don't know everything. You know what says. you should do is you should write on your website. You should post a legitimate, like, mad response to that site. Yeah, like, just take it to the next level, so that everyone gets confused if it's real. Or not. <laughs> like, like, you know what I mean? Like, so put it on Twitter and be like, "This sucks. How could these people do that?" You know? And but we've like, let our plan out on the air and it's live. <laughs> yeah, no we can't do it now. This. Everybody's gonna be no on. One, no one's <laughs> Oh, Stop reading the chat. Stop, guys. <laughs> Cut this off, Kevin. All right, well then, uh, pause. never mind. Pause it. Don't pause. go to that website. <laughs> now no, that go to the website. It's a funny fucking article. It is funny. Well, now that I know it's not funny. It's really funny. Guys. I read the article, and I was happy that a CEO would respond to our video. Wow. I didn't read the article and laugh at how funny it was. But can't they get in trouble for saying that she responded to the article if she didn't? I don't know. Yeah, you're not allowed to quote people, but I don't, I don't know. Because the Onion does that. Because it doesn't say it's like a fake art. That's the thing that's confusing. What are they supposed to do when big ass uh, letters at the top go, this is fake ass news? Well, how the fuck else? I mean, why no, have this what site? What they're supposed to do is write a funny article if it's a fucking funny article well, website. You know what's weird is it is funny yeah. if like you don't care about anything that's funny. I think the yeah. people who got the biggest <laughs> laugh are the people in the chat right, right now. now. Yeah. <laughs> and to you, you're welcome. <laughs> Life is satire. Yeah. Let's move on. Okay, I have something to talk about. Okay. I have heard this Ouya thing, right? It's yeah. a big deal. I just heard about it. Oh, sure. <laughs> Apparently, the video game awards. Yeah. Fake. Satire. The whole thing's fake. What? Yeah, the VGX. The, oh. oh, the whole thing's That's why Joel McHale was hosting, because he's funny. He's a comedian. Oh, oh shit. Oh. And he, that's, ah. that's why his hair is his fake. His hair's like, not everything's there. Fake, everything's you know? like, no. It's a big joke. Like, it's not even real. 
the awards they handed out, they're just fake. They're chocolate. It's because of Zionist media coverage, and they take over. (laughs) (laughs) You know, it's a big, I know, it's all underground hush-hush, Triluminati type stuff. Whatever. We're all not here. It's the Matrix. Yeah. Simulation theory. (laughs) Fuck. (laughs) (laughs) Somebody kill me. (laughs) No, it's it's fine. Who cares? It's cool. It's hard. You... We also, do you want to put out... We've done 282 podcasts without a mistake. This is our first one. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, no mistakes. None. Really fine. I don't care. No but mistakes. what's the next topic? Oh. I want to go talk about... I don't know. You're the captain seat. No, no. Yeah. I have an idea. Oh, we can man. talk about the Rift Between Sexes video. That Thank came out. you, Garrett. Thank the, God you're here. The, the only person with a brain. Between what? Hey. What? Look wow. at that. High five. Thank you. The only person with a brain. Ow. Ow. Hey, I'm, I'm, doing that. I'm included in the that? brain dead. I'm a guest, man. Doing that. I'm a guest. Uh, all right. Dallas has Ow. a brain. Your legs Thank hard. you. As well. Yes. Okay. So, moving on.